today is June 11, 2021, and reading the book of Isaiah, chapter 12, verse 2. Surely God is my salvation, I will trust and not be afraid. The Lord, the Lord himself is my strength and my defense. He has become my salvation. And in Romans chapter 8, verse 6, The mind governed by the flesh is death, but the mind governed by the spirit is life and peace. May the Lord add a blessing upon reading of his words. Trust me and don't be afraid, for I am your strength and song. Do not let fear dissipate your energy. Instead, invest your energy in trusting me and singing my song. The battle for control of your mind is fears, and years of worry have made you vulnerable to the enemy. Therefore, you need to be vigilant in guarding your toes. Do not despise this weakness in yourself since I am using it to draw you closer to me. Your constant need for me create an intimacy that is well worth all the effort. You are not alone in this struggle for your mind. My spirit living within you is ever, is ever ready to help in this striving. Ask him to control your mind. He will bless you with life and peace. Trust me and don't be afraid, for I am your strength and son. Father, we thank you for this beautiful day. Thank you for a good night rest. Thank you for your encouraging words again that we have to trust you because you are our strength and our song. And continue to help us, the Father, to entrust everything unto your care, not to worry, not to be afraid, not to fret, or not to. Be fearful in everything because you are with us. Your presence is within us. And continue, the Lord, to guide your children, Lord, and protect them, Lord, from harm and danger as they start the day. And thank you for keeping them in the hall of your hands and continue to guide them, O oh God. May they will continue, the Lord, to trust you as they face this day. Extend your hands, Lord, to our loved ones. Continue to keep them safe in the hand of your hands, too. And continue to keep them healthy and safe. And thank you for answering our prayers. Cleanse us, O God, from all our unrighteousness. And help us, the Lord, to keep our mind at peace with you so that we'll be able, the Lord, to enjoy the blessings that you have prepared for us today. So thank you for covering us with your precious blood and thank you also Lord for your direction today we commit everything unto your care and cleanse us oh God from all our unrighteousness and our prayers we commit everything unto your care you say pray amen God bless you and take care bye bye good morning today is June 12, 2021 I'll be reading to you in the book of Luke chapter 1 verse 79 to shine on those living in darkness and in the shadow of death, to guide our feet into the path of peace. And in 1 Corinthians chapter 10, verse 10, And do not grumble, as some of them did, and were killed by the destroying angel. May the Lord add a blessing upon reading of his words. Let me help you get through this day. There are many possible paths to travel between your getting up in the morning and your lying down at night. Stay alert to the many choice points along the way, being continually aware of my presence. You will get through this day one way or the other. One way is to moan and groan, stumbling along with, stuff, with shuffling feet. This will get you to the end of the day eventually, but there is a better way. You can choose to walk with me along the path of peace. Leaning on me as much as you need. There will still be difficulties along the way, but you can face them confidently in my strength. 
thank me for each problem you encounter and watch to see how I transform trials into blessing. Wow. Father, we thank you for a good night rest. Thank you for this day and thank you for keeping us safe as well as your words that encourages us to face a day with joy because we are confident that you are there for us and you will be with us. So help us, dear Father, to acknowledge your presence that we know and I know that you will protect each and every one of us in the hollow of your hands. So continue to embrace your children, Lord, with your comfort, strength, and victory. And whatever difficulties they will be facing today, I pray for your guidance and wisdom too. Help them, Father, whatever uh, difficulties that they are facing, will, may it be in their work, in their relationship, in their battles against every evil thing. I pray, Lord, that you will cover them with your precious blood and may your victory will be upon them. And thank you, Lord, for this day when you commit to you our steps. Continue to help us, the Father, as what you have promised us, that you will be with us from the rising of the sun to the going down. And whatever circumstances lies ahead of us, help us to trust you and to entrust everything unto your care. And pray for your blessing upon our loved ones, continue to protect them, Lord, from harm and danger, and continue, Lord, to strengthen their faith in you, as well as our faith to you. Help us also, Lord, to be conscious of your presence as we uh, face this day, and thank you for your words that encourages us once again that when we are with you, we are walking in the light. So thank you, Lord, for your words, and bless your children as we Start our day today. Cover us with your precious blood. Be with our loved ones. Protect them also, Lord. And thank you for answering our prayers. In Jesus' name, pray. Amen. Happy Independence Day po sa ating lahat. God bless. Take care. Bye-bye. Good morning. Today is June 13, 2021. I'll be reading to you in the book of John chapter 3, verse 8. John 3 verse 8. The wind blows wherever it pleases. You hear its sound, but you cannot tell where it comes from or where it is going. So, it is with everyone born of the Spirit. And in Galatians, Galatians chapter 5 verse 22. But the fruit of the Holy Spirit is love, joy, peace, forbearance, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, gentleness, and self-control. May the Lord add a blessing upon reading of His words. I am creating something new in you. A bubbling spring of joy that spills over into others' lives. Do not mistake this joy for your own or try to take credit for it in any way instead watch in the light as my spirit flows through you to bless others let yourself become a reservoir of the spirit's fruit. spirit's fruit your part is to live close to me open to all that i am doing in you don't try to control the streaming of my spirit through you. Just keep focusing on me as we walk through this day together. Enjoy my presence with permits, which permits you with love, joy, and peace. May the Lord mag-guide sa atin yung araw na ito. Kasi sabi niya dito, He is creating something new in our life. So, don't don't let uh, don't hinder the work of the Holy Spirit in your life so, because yan po ay ang um, blessing ni God sa atin na magiging blessing tayo sa iba. Father, we thank you for this beautiful day. Thank you for a good night rest and, and renewed strength and as we face this day, help us, Father, to be conscious of your presence, really, Lord, 
You are our great God who is the source of everything. So continue to make us a channel of blessing to others and let the Holy Spirit that is in us flow freely so that people will see you in our lives. So thank you Lord for your words and thank you for this day again where we can commit to you our steps and as your children Lord will gather to worship you prepare our hearts and mind the Lord for our holy communion and thank you for the day that you have given us and another hope another blessing and another joy and continue to embrace us oh god with your comfort strength and victory and thank you for answering our prayers in behalf of our sisters lords who have just got out from the hospital and for giving them the healing that they need as well as for the strength that they need and continue the lord to help them father as they face again another day in their employer's house and thank you lord for that would be so good to us extend your hands lord to our loved ones and pray that your inner strength will be upon them also and continue to protect them lord from harm and danger and continue to guide them oh god in the way that you wanted them to do and thank you for answering our prayers cleanse us oh god from all our unrighteousness and thank you father for that we've been so good to us in jesus name pray amen good morning and god bless you see you bye bye